Hi, welcome to Patrick's Tech Show. I'm Patrick John. Today's episode is not going to be about a tech repair or a tech review. It is about a tech experience. An experience called eSports. For those that don't know, eSports is when you play a video game or computer game competitively and it can lead to a tournament with people watching and a prize at the end. I was in an eSports tournament, which is why I'm making this video today. The game I played is called Avian Knights. It's on the Atari VCS and Steam, but they're planning on putting it on PlayStation, Xbox, and Nintendo Switch as well. Avian Knights is an arcade style arena game with an online high scoreboard. You are a knight riding on top of a giant bird, trying to clear the screen of the enemies using the various weapons available. If your knight is killed, your bird can lay an egg, hatch a new knight, and pick him up to continue fighting. If your bird is attacked without a knight, your bird will die. The top eight players are selected to compete in person at Flynn's Retrocade in Roy, Utah. Third place receives $1,000. Second place receives $5,000. And first place receives, oh, oh, $10,000. And so our story begins when I received the message that I was a finalist. I went to the airport and got on a plane. I was lucky and ended up sitting beside a really nice guy. The plane landed and I had the day to explore Ogden, Utah. At the end of the day, I went to the hotel to go to bed, where I got to meet my roommate and fellow Avian Knights player, Hippie Kenny. And Yorkies, dude, I'm baked, bro. I'm f***ing hungry, dog. Should we go, like, go down the road and get something to munch on, man? No, I have some uh, crickets. They're bacon and cheese flavored. Did you want any? Bacon cheese crickets. Man, these look yummy, dog. Dude. Man, man. Oh my god, dude. What the f dude? Oh my god. <laughs> oh man. Mm. Man, them things are good, bro. What the f you are geese, dog? Yummy, eh, oh my god, they're good. The next day was the day of the tournament. I walked inside Flynn's Retrocade. And there was the competition. Retro Man 21. Driller Joe. Mock Duck. Hippie Kenny. Matty D. Red Splat. The director and Yorkies TV. Flint's Retrocade, by the way, is a really awesome arcade that even had a soda bar in the back. I just couldn't believe I was seeing Mock Duck in real life. I had him on it as a guest in some of my videos, and it was only possible because of Zoom. Oh my god, Mock Duck. I never thought I'd meet you in real life. Yeah, yeah, it's nice to meet you. And then I met Retro Man and Driller Joe, two of the best players on the Atari VCS.
The event started with two warm-up tournaments. The first was a one-on-one -on -one challenge to see who could get the highest score in three minutes. Alright, next up, Retro Man versus Yorkies TV. Okay, you ready? Yes, sir. Alright. Hey, where's Yorkie? Where is he? Back here. Oh, hey, buddy. Hi. You okay? The second warm up tournament was a two person team deathmatch. I was with the director and we won. And they gave us these cool Avian Knight statue trophies. Then they gave everyone all kinds of goodies a jersey with your gamer tag on it to play during the main event. A t-shirt, a physical Avian Knights comic book, and trading cards of all the players. They were very gracious. The tournament began, and the competition was stiff. All right, next up for the World Tournament in Avian Knights. Where's Yorkie's TV? Oh, no. The director ended up in third place. Mock Duck in second. And Retro Man 21 in first. Drowning in disappointment, I had to get away from it all. So I fled to the mountains to process what just happened. Before the tournament, I was just happy to be there. Didn't care what place I got. But when I actually lost, it hurt. Being in such a beautiful, peaceful place, though, staring out from the mountains, it was hard to hold on to these sad feelings. A thought came to me. A wonderful thought. Most people lose, which means losing is normal, which means I am normal. We are a world of losers, and it feels good.